again. Thank you, come again. Yo! Welcome back to the Zero Power and today, boys, I'm about to show y'all boys the best defense y'all need to be running after the patch update. And look, bro, make sure y'all boys like, comment, subscribe, follow me on K. The links in the description. And let's get into this video. All right, boys. So look, this I'm about to show y'all all the best defenses y'all need to be running. So first of all, we're in the Kansas City defensive paper, all right? Kansas City, it has every every formation you need, bro. Every formation you need is is gonna be in here for this for the best defenses in the game. Now, first one I'm gonna start off is with the Nico three three blitz defense. This is the best one that a lot of pros is using, and this you work for my and play now and franchise. All right. Now, what we're gonna do first thing like I always do is go to my substitutions. All right. And what you wanna do, you wanna make sure you have safeties in the box right here. Safeties. And that's using the linebacker with lurker, lurk artist, or 90 plus speed. All right, boys. Um, next thing, have your best D defense in the game. That's D lineman, cornerbacks, all that good stuff. Now, the next thing which I want to do is come out and go to coach adjustment adjustments. Have auto flip on off, auto alignment base, option defense aggressive, and everything else. You can now look. This is the best base defense, but y'all can make adjustments to it however your opponent plays. I can. I'm just showing y'all the best base defense of how to run this. Okay. Now. What the play I want to show y'all is this play right here, cover for drop. All right, boys. So look, let's go ahead. I'm gonna show y'all play this blitz with the halfback blocking because I know a lot of people say, well, blitzes are good when a halfback is on the route. I think it's even harder to show a blitz with the halfback on the route, even with than the blitz uh, working with a half with a halfback blocking. You know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead. Let's look at it. Lot hook. Let's get this play right here. Boom. Halfback is blocking. Now, how you boys want to run this play? is you always want that slot corner on the right side so you see how that slot I, I meant to flip it on the before i even came out of here but make sure it's on that right side i always run this blitz so to the left side so what you want to do is press right on your d-pad spread your linebackers to the left okay hold on spread your line touch your linebackers to the left like this so that's how it's going to look then what you're going to do is blitz all linebackers and then you're going to go ahead and press so this is how it's going to look okay now you want to um next thing you want to do what i like to do is bring this guy down just a little bit to like right here and then bring this guy down to the same spot okay you're going to use it this guy all right you're going to use it this holding guy this is the guy you're going to use it okay now next thing you want to do what for, for this blister to work so people won't get open what i like to do if i'm sending heat i like to play underneath coverage so what you want to do is press y or triangle underneath all right, so now it's going to be hard flats and basically they're going to play a lot of the drags and end routes and slats and that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Now, the next thing we'd like to do is create like a cover three out of cover four. And the reason I come out in cover four is the simple reason that if I get quick snap, I always have deep, deep, like deep defenders. So like them inside quarters, outside quarters will always be going deep. So I won't really get bombed too much. Plus, the blitz will always be on the field. But even though if I do get quick snap, like I said, I always have coverage on the outside. You know what I'm saying? Now, next thing is, see, press Y two times in that LB guy. You want to put him in a hook curl. And then you want to go ahead and put the Y guy in a, or sometimes what I have to do is either put him in the inside third, or you can leave him in that inside quarter like this. And then in order for this, for this, um, for this blitz, I mean, not in order, but you can do this if you want to. Press RB guest pass, and that's the guest play now i recommend really only doing that if it's third and fourth down or if it's like a crucial like fourth quarter your opponent is down you need to get down the field and score all right don't always guess pass because you know sometimes you can get pancake and you don't want that but if you can shoot the block even if you do guess pass you can shoot the gap and things of that nature so therefore that can help in your favor by learning how to shoot gaps and stop the run you know what i'm saying now after you do the guest pass, just wait for him to snap it. I'm gonna stand right here with my user. Watch it, watch it. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I watch stick at the blitz and the blitz comes in. That's exactly what y'all boys want, okay? Now, that's what I'm saying. This defense, I'm telling y'all, bro, this defense, this blitz is one of the best and you can adjust to it however you like to, however you want. And you see right here, right? Look at this, watch this right here. You see how the halfback is blocking? Even with the halfback blocking, the blitz, that blitz is still elite, bro. It's still elite and it's, it's I'm telling y'all, this nickel 3-3 blitz is really good. So let's do that. And if you want to do it in real time, it's really easy. 
Um, sometimes you can man people up if you want to, you know what I'm saying? Even if you don't get off all your proper adjustments, this blitz will still be elite, bro. No, I'm, just trying to, I'm just trying to show you even with the half bait blocking, this blitz will still work. Watch the left side of the field. Everything is back. He don't even have time to throw the curl route or the corner route because the blitz comes in. Now, second blitz I want to show you all, second defense right quick, is the out of one at 4-3, even 6-1, okay? Remember, this is the Kansas City. And how y'all boys want to set this up is very simple. First, coach adjustments, auto flip on on. You want to run 30 flats, five curl flats. All right, boys, do not cut on zone. I mean, match, but if you do cut on match, it's because if you put any hook curls on the field, then we'll match onto anything because they're on the default. But if you don't, you know, if you don't worry about that, just leave default off. All right, boys, just leave it off. Okay. We're in Kansas City, defensive playbook. And what you want to do now is go to substitutions. You want to go ahead and make sure you have a linebacker and that's elite, bro. I mean, like, you got to be 90 plus, either 90, 90 plus B or have a lurker or lurk artist. All right, boys. Now, go ahead. Oh, and also, on these two outside guys, you want to make sure you have either pick artist or lurk artist or lurker on these two outside guys. All right, boys. Now, let's go ahead. And, um, but if you don't have it, it's cool. You can still run it, but it's just going to be. It's just even better with those abilities, okay? And the play we're going to run is cover four quarters, all right, boys? Uh, now, this is really, this defense is really elite against, uh, vert uh, not verticals, but bunch, okay? Now, how I run this defense is press Y, show blitz, okay? Y, show blitz. And then what you want to do is slant your line, slant your line, your D-line, blitz all linebackers. But what you want to do is press Y, then A, back off the B guy, Y, then A, and then back off that X guy. And then what you want to do is put those two guys in cloud flats like this. Press RB, gas pass, and then just wait for him to snap it. Wait for him. Boom. That's the left side, right side. And that's actually a great pass. And if your opponent is making passes like that, that's actually that's cool. You know what I'm saying? That's great passes for your that's that, that's absolutely fine. Now, that the first way I just showed y'all was like an all-out blitz defense. Now sometimes what you need to do is is do something like this this is the called the double maple defense is putting uh your linebacker a and a curl flat and put x and a curl flat press rb guest pass and then slant inside on your line and then just wait for him to snap it boom i'm gonna run right here look at, look at now look at the pressure now nothing was open that's perfect defense that's exactly what y'all boys want and the halfback was blocking that's i'm trying to tell y'all bro look right here look that same pass you tried to throw last time right back that's that's just a curl flat that's why i say use the curl flats in the double maple feature it's really good right now in madden 24. now if you're if the opponent is using is not putting no routes on that left side of the field use that to your advantage you know what i'm saying so let's do that same defense right but what you want to do is leave x blitzing so now you're blitzing that fifth person okay you're blitzing a fifth person and sometimes uh sometimes what i like to do with my um linebackers is press right on my d-pad and spread them like that so that the curl flat can get to the outside faster and then rb guest pass remember only if third or fourth down or if it's like a, if you know your opponent is going to pass the ball okay but if i'm to snap it boom watch look at the field nothing everything is back that's one of the best defenses right now in the game okay boys so and the last one i don't want to get too much in detail for this one it's very simple it's been good for years the dollar three two method is really just running 30s and fives come out in db fire two this is one of the best defenses in the game um and then this is say he come out in the play right here seam divide all you want to do is make sure both of the slot corners is press so i'm gonna press y a r b press r b guest pass blitz my user and then wait for him to snap it watch it watch it i'm there that's actually my that's that's a user fault that's a user fault that was 100 percent on me but y'all boys see pressure still got there now let's go ahead and do oh my, my fault one thing wait for him to snap it wait for hold on wait for him to snap it wait 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 boom i'm gonna run right there and I, i'm just not getting it but that's 100 percent on me but you see everything is back and your opponent you're making your opponent nervous so let's do that one more time but this time i'm gonna run straight to it since my opponent only wants to throw right there i'm gonna run right there and that's a pick so that's one of the best defenses too is db fire now you can adjust to it how your opponent plays but that's one of the best defenses y'all boys can run right now in mat 24 so watch right here Look at this guy off the edge. Look at those guys, bro. They just, just, just screaming. And look at that right there. I'm gonna go right there, and that's perfect, perfect defense. Okay. Um, 
one more defense, one more. And this is like one of the elite ones that people are running right now. It's it's kind of glitchy, bro. I really don't like running it, but it's the um where you go to audibles, right? Go ahead and put a uh, cover for a job container in there. And the play you're going to come out in is double safety go. This is like one of the elite ones. And you're going to, you're going to click on that, right? So they come out in this play, drive our corner. See how both those safeties come down. What you're going to do is press X and come and audible to cover for drive contain. And man, this is what people is running right now. It's kind of glitchy, bro. And then what they do, they blitz both corners like this. And then slide the sign on a line and press RB, guest pass. And then just wait for them to snap it. This is just a defense like people are running right now it's like it, it takes some time to get used to running and adjustments and things in nature but yeah this is just one that people are running and another thing that they're doing is blitzing the, the inside linebacker so if you don't want to send heat off the edge um it's like a like a disengage he do come in free almost every time so watch right here i'm gonna send heat off that right side but leave that guy in a zone from that left side and watch this rp guest pass wait for him to snap it wait for him i'm gonna run right run left and watch right there and that's a pick but y'all boys see that guy he i don't know what it is but it was the halfback isn't blocking that guy's going to come in free like a hundred like 90 percent of the time and it's going to be like instant pressure and it's just it is what it is you know what i'm saying it's just how this game is right now but make sure y'all boys like comment subscribe follow me on kick and i'll see y'all boys in the next video